What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Aso, and welcome to the first edition here of Series E Jeopardy. I've got three of our players from this season, Razo, Jonathan Tene, and Solstice, all joining me in the studio today. Of course, they're in town for the 5K face-off happening here very soon, and I'm excited to have them in the studio. We're going to play some Jeopardy here, so let's bring up the rules really fast so I can run down all of that for our players. Very simple, four categories, three of them geared around Guilty Gear, and then one maybe a little bit different, and uh, each category, all the questions are the same value. They're all 100 points, so you pick a category, and we'll just work our way top to bottom. The most important thing, of course, make sure you answer in the form of a question, and there is a daily double hiding in there somewhere. One thing to note, if you do answer a question wrong, the other two players do have the opportunity to buzz in. I would just ask that you wait to buzz in until after I ask for you to do so. Someone gets one wrong. So, sound good? Mm -hmm. Cool. We're ready to go. So let's bring up the game here. Our three players ready to play our categories today. Lore, frame data, esports history, and overdrive. Uh, let's give it to Jonathan here, our Series E champion for Season 1, uh, to pick the first category. So where are we going to start, Jonathan? Uh, I think we're going to start frame data. All right. Let's go to frame data for 100 points. This Potemkin special has 28 startup frames and plus 19 on block. Um, what is Garuda Impact? What is Garuda Impact is correct. That's 100 points for Jonathan. All right, where are we going next? Uh, frame data. All right, right back to frame data. Jonathan feel confident. This sole bad guy normal has 11 startup frames and minus 5 on block. Jonathan. Soul 5H. 5H is correct. <laughs> Ooh, one thing. I won't punish you there. One thing. Make sure to answer in the form of a question. I'll give, I'll give you that one. I'll give you that one. I'll give you that one. We'll let it slide. We'll let it slide. All right. Uh, what's next? Um, frame data. We're going right back to frame data. Jonathan, feeling yeah. good about it. Frame data for 100 points. This Nagoriyuki special has 14 startup frames and zero on block. Solstice. Pass the mic over. Solstice, what do you got? Shoot, I don't know the pattern. Uh, what is Shizura Yuki? Incorrect. Yeah, I don't know. No. Anybody else want to buzz in? Jonathan. What is Kamoriyuki? Moriyuki is correct. That's another 100 points for Jonathan. Crushing the frame data category. Are we going to close it out? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Last one in frame data for 100 points. we got to see Razo get in here. This Faust normal has five startup frames and minus two on block. Razo. Uh, what is Faust 5P? Correct. Razo on the board with 100 points there with the 5P. And now the board is yours. Frame data is gone. We got lower esports history and overdrive left. Uh, let's do let's do overdrive. Okay, let's go to overdrive. First clue for 100 points. This character's overdrive fires two lasers. Razo. What is Calvados? Incorrect. Who else? Anybody else got an answer? Jonathan. Who is Ramothal? That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind the former Ram main dropping that question. And the other Ram main a little slow on the buzzer. Uh, okay, Jonathan, 400 points. Uh, overdrive? Overdrive. Back to overdrive here. This character's overdrive <laughs> involves a giant shadow sword. Solstice. Who is Zotto 1? That is correct. <laughs> I'm 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 very conflicted right now. The Rams not getting the Ram question. The Zato too slow on the buzzer. That's okay. Solstice, the board's yours. We're trying to get in the positive. What do we got? Let's take us to lore. Okay, let's go to lore for a hundred points. Starting at the top of the category. This character got caught in a time slip and bounces through time and space. Raza. Uh, who is Axel Lowe? Correct. 
Razo in the positive there with 100 points. Looking to chase down Jonathan. Plenty of clues left on the board. What's next? Uh, let's do overdrive again. Back to overdrive for 100 points here. This character's overdrive launches a giant fan. Jonathan. Uh, who is Anji Mito? Correct. Jonathan hitting 500 points now. I see the government. You got to make sure you don't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, overdrive again. All right. We're closing out overdrive here. This character's <laughs> overdrive involves a wheelchair. Solstice. Who is Faust? Correct. Solstice on the board here. Seven clues left on the board. Razo and Solstice tied at 100 points. 500 for Jonathan Tenna here. And seven clues left to go. What's next? We're going back to Lore? Of course. All right. I love it. I'm about it. Lore for 100 points here. The second clue in the category. This character is the first mate of the Jellyfish Pirates. Razo. Who is May? Correct. Who is May? Is the answer there? Two hundred points for Razo. Uh, let's let's do let's do lore again. All right, we're sticking to lore, and that is our one hidden daily double. So you can wager up to two hundred points. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll wager. Okay, so if I wager a hundred, you can just do no. You can just wager up to what you have. Okay. Um, so you can do 100 or 200 points. Uh, 100. Okay. For 100 points here for Razo, the third clue in lore. And our daily double. This character is a time-traveling magician. Who is Eno? Correct. Who is Eno? That's 100 points there for Razo. All right. Back to the board. One question left. One clue left in lore. Uh, let's finish up war. Okay, let's do it. We'll leave esports history for last. This character <laughs> is the current Secretary of Defense for the United States of America. Jonathan. Uh, who is Gold Lewis Dickinson? <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Where are Gold Lewis mains in this tournament? So disappointing. All right, uh, one category left, so we know where we're going. Let's go to esports history. Four clues left. Jonathan with the lead at 600 points. Let's start it off. This person won first place in Arc Revo America 2021 finals. Razo. Who is Hotashi? That is correct. I can imagine Jonathan didn't want to answer that question. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Jonathan did make it out of groups. So I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I could I could not take the opportunity. You got me. Talk, you got talk me a little there. snag on Jonathan. Talk a little bit on on Raza. It's all it's all good fun, right? Uh, let's go back to esports history again. <laughs> this person won first place in CEO 2021 for Guilty Gear Strive. Solstice. Who is K7 Show Off? Correct. Another hundred points. Solstice on the board once again. Back to esports history, two clues remaining for 100 points. This person won first place in Bum's Birthday Bash 2022 for Guilty Gear Strive. Jonathan. Uh, who is Tempest? That is correct. Tempest takes Bum's Birthday Bash. And the final clue of the day here for 100 points in esports history, this person Won first place in Texas Showdown 2022 for Guilty Gear Strive. Jonathan. Uh, who's Don? Who is Don? Correct. And that means Jonathan Tene is our champion here with 800 points. The winner yeah. <laughs> of Series E Jeopardy. Uh, thank you so much for coming on to hang out, all of you. Yeah. Razo, I'm sorry I had to throw that shade there. That was uh, all. all, all. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, uh, folks. We're going to get back to the show here.